This is an audio interface. This one right here is called the Focus Right. This was the Scarlet Solo third generation. This one right here will cost you about $100. I've had it for about a year now. I'm gonna show you how to hook it up. I'm mainly focusing on people that have Mac because that's what I'm using right now. So I'm gonna show you three things. What equipment you'll need, how to hook it up, and how to hook it up to FL Studio. All right, let's move on to the first part. What equipment do you need? First, you're gonna need the microphone, then the audio interface, and then the cord that came with. And Apple usually doesn't have any entrances, so you're gonna need one of these. You're gonna need a microphone cord and a pop filter. First, you wanna grab the cord that came with the box, then grab the Scarlet, then you wanna insert it in the back. And the other end, you wanna put it in the computer. This is basically a headphone extension, you wanna put it in the back. And that's pretty much it for the equipment. All right, so now, usually when I log in regularly, I get this pop-up up here. It's detecting that I hooked it up to the computer. I believe it just takes you to their website and it allows you to download a link. Just go on their website and download the one for your device. If it's a Windows, download the Windows. If it's a Mac, get the Mac. Once you download that, just follow the process of downloading. And there's a thing that I actually struggled with and I didn't understand why. Whenever I hooked up my device, it wouldn't, it wouldn't work. I didn't know how to record or anything. So what you have to do, you have to go in settings and do a few things. Here, let me show you. Let's probably open up your settings, go to sound, go on output and click Scarlet Solo and put input. And also you also want to put, once you activate that in your settings, it should be hooked up. So now that you got all that downloaded, you open up FL Studio and go to options and then click audio settings. And then on the first one, audio devices, you want to click on Scarlet Solo. Everything should be hooked up now. What you want to do is open up your mixer, click a channel, just click any, and then you want to go here. You want to put input one. You don't want to put input two or or this one. You got to put input one. So the reason why is because the Scarlet has one input. So the second input is for, for an audio interface to be able to record multiple instruments. It could be mics, guitars. It could be just more than one device. But on the one that I have, there's only one. Once you do click that, make sure this is on. If it's blue, you're not gonna record anything. But if it's if it's purple, you'll be able to record. Okay, now how do I actually record? Some people I've noticed that some people record differently depending on what, what they use. I like to open up Edison and then put play, put on play, and then click record. And then I just click this, and then whatever my mic picks up, I'll be recording. If you need any help with anything Anything that has to do with music production, and I possibly know, leave in the comments. I could probably just figure it out for you and try to teach you. But alright, that's it. Bye.